Hey, everybody. Welcome to GMP Reacts. Uh, just in the nick of time, we have been saying we need some Iron Maiden. It's been, what, like seven years since they released an album? 666 years. Yeah, 666 yeah. years. And I think this is their 69th album. Oh, uh, but they finally released a single called The Writing on the Wall. So we are going to check it out. Is it the writing on the wall for them, or is it their oh, future? I hope not. Oh. We're going to find out. All right. Ready? Here we go. Go, Juice. Okay, a little Western vibe. It sounds she, like death. Is that an Iron Maiden shirt? Yeah. Belshazzar's Feast. That's the Babylonian king in the Bible. Yeah. It's, it's cool. It's like all good. animated. Yeah. Shred, maybe it was you saying this had like a dead or alive vibe to it. Yeah. It does. Like Bon Jovi dead or alive. Yeah. Oh, I love all the, the like their airplanes crashed, the Iron Maiden airplane. It was probably Ed Force One. Ed Force yeah. One. Yeah. yeah, it was. It had the plane that Bruce Dickinson flies, yeah. Oh, oh. Scorpion. Wow, even a scorpion took it. And the Reapers ride in their bikes. <laughs> yeah. I really like Read how this ride. film uh, that started with that kind of like good tone acoustic and built in there. There's Bruce. He's sounding great too. The mix is a little weird on this. You'll see people saying that. Yeah. Like he's a little bit low. There's a better mix on Spotify too. China. <laughs> I think the Reapers are the heroes here. We'll see about that. Of course. Uh -oh. In the key of D minor, saddest of all keys. Uh -huh. Which is uh, you know, very British. Do you consider this a ballad of sorts? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got, got a like, feel for it. Epic uh, story. You know what? <laughs> what the hell? And the animation guys are on point. Yeah. Oh, it's getting whap juice. Straight in to the oh. idea. That doesn't make you look so good, does it? No. <laughs> oh, no. I guess he's, now he's doing great. Don't get into Belfazar's feast. Just the big wigs. We got a showdown about to happen here. I feel like it's pretty catchy, but like it's a little repetitive drone. <laughs> How dare you criticize Aaron it up. Maiden. <laughs> It's good to hear a song. Yeah. Yeah, well, this is a nice reprieve from all that D minor sadness. Yeah. Well, that's cool. Man. Rebuilding. A lot of apocalypse theme in oh, modern yeah. metal. Yeah, that's there's Eddie. 
That's the uh, Senjutsu cover. That's what it looks like, which is the new album coming out in September. Ah. Oh, I like that. What he did there. Death War Plague and uh, Evil Death on the Sin. Extended solo section. Yeah. Yeah, it's a, yeah, you think that's Eddie Luke? Could be, huh? Looks like Eddie. Yeah. The they mascot, all. Iron Maid's mascot. Oh, yeah. Wow. Clown music. Took it. <laughs> There's the play. Oh, it's the four horsemen. Oh, yeah. yeah. It was right. like war, death, plague, and I missed the last one. The revelation deal. Yeah. Right. Death we're playing fam. Damn it. Chose to make his character like 3D animated, and everything else is like 2D. Yeah, it's true. He's like the most real thing, right? Like here's Adam and Eve. Yeah, I was wondering if that was an idea. They really uh, made that clear with the apple. But they had Adam. Adam Yeah, yeah. that's that's not how it went down. Rewriting the history there. (laughs) Yeah. And the nuclear explosion. There was a nuclear. Well, I guess this is the second time around. Yeah, <laughs> second apocalypse. That was pretty interesting. Really cool story. Yeah. Uh, I wouldn't say it's my favorite Iron Maiden song, but uh, there's some nice moments in there. Uh, really good guitar solo, bridge. It is uh, nice these days to hear guitar solos. A lot yeah. of you know metal doesn't focus on that much. Right. Yeah. And um, I know Bruce is just coming back from throat cancer, so you got to give him some props there. Right. For yeah. Him doing a record. I mean, I thought he sounded pretty good. Of course, it's recorded, so that you're always at the benefit of the studio. But sure, <laughs> I wouldn't right. say that's Bruce in his prime necessarily, yeah. but uh, it's not bad. Yeah, not bad. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I I agree that there was a lot of um, uh, it it that did not explore a lot. No, you know, in terms of the music, uh, so maybe like a five out of six point nine okay. for me. Because right. um, it was fine. Like, that'd be like background music for me. Yeah, because it just drones on. That's what I was saying. So, a little yeah. repetitive. There was a really big extended solo section, which helped break it up. Uh, yeah. But I think that Iron Maiden does a lot of repetitive. Some of their riffs are catchier than that. And you yeah. can, like, get, you can really get into them for a whole song. That one was. What we not should bad, do, though, but... is get into an Iron Maiden and then listen to Iron Maiden. Oh. oh. Would you guys get into an Iron Maiden? Yeah. Yeah. Post your answer in the comments below. Probably wouldn't be the worst way to die. I think maybe getting no, I eaten by a shark bad. would be <laughs> up there. But uh, <laughs> yeah, I guess we Iron Maiden into... pretty bad. It's like a big iron <laughs> casket, and you get in. It's got spikes, right? You close the yeah. door, yeah, and the spikes go through you. Yeah, and you know this is a real torture device, and it's it, true. It, it would take people days, you know, to right? Because yeah. the spikes don't go all the way through there; they just <laughs> puncture you, so you like bleed out. It might, it might hit you depending on how tall you are. So it might hit you right or, in the heart, or yeah, yeah. If you you get you lucky, if it hits you in the right spot to kill you, right, right, it yeah. goes, goes through <laughs> yeah. your eye and takes your brain out, and then that's you're, ideal. That's yeah. ideal. Yeah. Uh, so boy, that would be brutal sitting there for <laughs> days just bleeding out. Oh. Yep. All right, guys, give us your 69 cents in the comments below. Absolutely. We'll see you next time. Watch all. Keep it back.